Okay, so that's the foundation of the industrial Internet of Things, Industry 4, digital transformation. Digital transformation is when you are trying to become like Tesla and Amazon. All right, so just real quick, my name is Walker Reynolds. I am a solutions architect. I have a company called 4.0 Solutions. Um, we run IIoT.University, where we educate engineers and leaders in manufacturing on how to do digital transformation. I presented last May, uh, so a, a year ago, May, uh, and I did my foundational presentation on digital transformation, Industry 4.0, why is Tesla awesome, why is Amazon awesome. We had a whole conversation around what, what those topics are, and then I went through some examples and showed you what a, a manufacturer's journey looks like in digital transformation, okay? This year, I'm gonna do an update. So, the fourth industrial revolution is over, and the fifth industrial revolution has started. And most people don't, most people don't know that. And there's all these buzzwords. There's uh, IIoT, right? So, so that's the industrial internet of things. The industrial internet of things is the internet of things for industry. And an internet of things is just a bunch of smart things connected together. That's all it is. And what does it take to be a smart thing? You have to have network connectivity, and you have to be able to inform the network of something about yourself, right? The industrial internet of things is the internet of all the things connected together in industry. I also asked you the question last year, why is Amazon awesome? Everybody agrees Amazon's awesome. And they're awesome because they can, you can buy anything you want from, from Amazon, ship to your door in 48 hours or less, 98% of the time. But we asked the question, how does Amazon achieve that? How does Amazon get us everything we want for the best price in 48 hours or less? By the way, it's 99% of Americans. 99% of the American population. Lots of smart people in this room. If I were to say to everyone in this room, we're gonna build a company that's gonna get anything anyone wants, 99% of Americans, 98% of the time, at the best price in 48 hours or less, tell me how you would do that. You, what you do is you sit down in front of a whiteboard and you try to figure out how to achieve that. How do you achieve that? The answer is you don't know. Unless you were here last year and we told you how Amazon does it, you don't know. Here's how they do it. They predict what you're gonna buy with 98% accuracy 60 days before you buy it. Now, I've told you how they do it. How do they do that? So now the new mandate to all the smart people in this room is, what we're gonna do is we're gonna predict what people buy 60 days before we, they buy it with 98% accuracy. Huge computers, lots of data, lots of iterations, continuously. Right. All the time. Everything, does everybody know what data is? Tesla. Yeah, data, data, is, <laughs> data is something that happened. It's an event. It's something that happened and when. That's all it is. Data is never actionable. That is, just by looking at a single data point, you cannot do anything with that. Okay, so if, if you can look at a data point, a transition, an event, and what time that happened, and you can act on it, that's not data. That's information, okay? We take data and we turn it into information, digital data. We've been collecting data in the US economy, we're gonna talk about the American economy, for since the, the second industrial revolution, really, with clipboards and paper, when the assembly lines first came. We've been collecting data, okay? Scientists were collecting data before that. How, what, how, Good is the data that human beings collect. Josh? Terrible. Okay. Okay. Not only is it terrible, it is abjectly terrible. So do any of you work in a place where human beings collect data, write it down on pieces of paper, or put it in spreadsheets? It is fucking excrement. It is absolute garbage. <laughs> World-class data, if you, the Japanese who are incredibly obedient, they're incredibly diligent, they're incredibly committed to following the rules, but of all societies in the world, they are the most committed. Do you wanna know how reliable their data is? 
60% fidelity. So the reason Tesla is awesome and the reason Amazon is awesome is because they were the first two companies to understand you cannot trust human beings collecting data. That's number one. And number two, all data matters. So when we talk about digital transformation, digital transformation is about becoming a company that understands that all data in the business, digital data, collected off of smart things, so off of computers and PLCs and sensors. You know, we have somebody here who does vibration sensors. We have somebody, you guys do hardware ops for managing all of the IIoT infrastructure. We have industrial PC vendors. That creates digital data, events, okay? Tesla and Amazon collects all of that. Every single event, without exception. And then they use algorithms, machine learning and artificial intelligence, specifically regression. I'm not gonna get into all the deep technical, but regression is basically looking at data and saying, for every value X, what is the likely outcome Y? Okay, for, so let's say I wanted to draw a, a corollary between the set point on my thermostat and the temperature in my room, okay? Those are directly related. We know that if we set the thermostat down, the temperature should go down, right? But what if I open the window and I turn the thermostat up? Is it possible that the temperature is not going to go up or, not, or go down? Right? There's a variable that I have to take into account. All right? Machine learning is all about using software to find correlations between data points. There's two main types, regression and clustering. Regression is testing a hypothesis you came up with. I want to use an algorithm for every value x. What's the likely outcome y? And clustering is trying to find patterns in data you can't see with the naked eye. Relationships you are not aware of. And Tesla and Amazon have mastered the art of finding those relationships. Okay, so that's the foundation of the industrial internet of things, industry four, digital transformation. Digital transformation is when you're trying to become like Tesla and Amazon. 